Hello. On this occasion of Dr. Raymond Byersdorfer's memorial service at the Unitarian Church, November 10, 2018, we would like to restate our commitment to fighting for our community rights, for fighting to protect our own community's fresh drinking water, because the attack continues in the state of Ohio, we have a very corrupt government. The money is running the state. Big industry money. Our governors, our state legislature are all controlled. All the politicians are paid by oil and gas money. And the result is that we are not represented, that the public health and safety is threatened by one specific industry that ALEC, the American Exchange Council, made sure to ensure that they were exempt from clean air, clean water, clean land, right to know laws. All of our state legislatures, all of our legislators rather, who are ALEC members, have passed laws that have worked for the fracking industry and against the people. There's physician gag laws that you cannot tell anyone what chemicals made a person sick. There's the proprietary chemical laws that you don't have to reveal what chemicals you're using in a frack. It goes on and on. HB 463 was the first attack directly at uh, local control as far as our Ohio Constitution guarantees that we're allowed to get signatures on a ballot initiative to get something on the ballot to vote yes or no, but they made a law that said your local Board of Elections can knock any citizen ballot initiative off the ballot. In Columbus, they got 18,000 signatures to put their community bill of rights to protect themselves against injection wells on the ballot and they were knocked off the ballot by HB 463 when Youngstown had already won in the Ohio Supreme Court and that was declared that the Board of Elections overstepped their purview. They could not do that. It was against Ohio's Constitution. This is huge money, ruining our laws, ruining our rights. Everybody get up and fight. In the memory of Dr. Raymond Byersdorfer, please get up and fight. And I'd just like to remind you that I pledge allegiance to the earth and to the flora, fauna, and human life that it supports, one planet indivisible, with safe air, water, and soil, economic justice, and equal rights, and peace for all. And I hope that you all will too. Thanks. Thank you, Lynn.